Imagine having to consult the instructions manual for a problem that suddenly occurred to, let's say, your smartphone, only to realize that the manual is over 200,000 pages long, does not have a table of contents, and that you can only understand about one word in every 50 that you try to read. You know that there must be important information in there, I mean, it's the instructions manual, but only understanding a mere 2% of it severely limits the options that you have in trying to solve the problem. Believe it or not, we face a very similar situation when we try to consult the manuals of our own bodies, in other words, our DNA, for problems that our bodies face, such as diseases. Again, we know that there must be important information in there. I mean, it's the instructions manual, but our DNA is like a code. We may be able to read it, but we can only interpret a shocking 2% of it. One way we can try to decipher this code is by associating parts of our DNA with what we can see. For example, suppose that a genetic disorder causes people to wear Santa hats, regardless of the season. We can visually identify individuals from a crowd who are wearing Santa hats, kindly ask for a DNA sample, and then compare their DNA to that of people who don't have the disease. Of course, there is no such thing as a Santa hat disease, but we can look for signs of real diseases among cell populations under the microscope and check their DNA. But unfortunately, this process is not so easy. Imagine having to look for one individual wearing a Santa hat in the middle of, let's say, Shibuya Crossing, one of the most crowded places on earth, from afar with a pair of binoculars. Then imagine having to wade through the crowd just to pull them out and ask for a DNA sample. Doesn't that sound exhausting? Is there a way that we can accelerate, maybe even automate this process so that we don't go insane trying? And that is actually what I'm trying to do. I'm currently developing a method to accelerate the process of deciphering our DNA with the help of our good friend, artificial intelligence, or AI. At our lab, we have developed a machine that allows us to very quickly take photos of individual cells, apply AI techniques similar to that of facial recognition, and then separate cells that we want from a population all in real time. The key point, we can do this at a rate of hundreds of cells every second. So if we let AI hold the binoculars for us, we can more efficiently look through large cell populations at superhuman speeds. Apply this to populations with unique differences all across their DNA, and we can begin to assign meaning to what we previously thought to have been gibberish. Perhaps one day when we finally decipher all of our DNA, we can more properly consult the instructions manuals of our bodies, now complete with a table of contents, to more quickly and efficiently look for solutions to problems that our bodies face. Thank you.